Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel, Alyssa the Adventure, and in today's video I am going to be doing one of your guys' video suggestions. So somebody suggested that I do a mystery fidget blind bag unboxing, but the mystery fidget blind bag is homemade. So I am going to be doing that in today's video. So before I get started, I just wanted to let you guys know, if you didn't already know, that the winner of my 100th subscriber giveaway is Unique DIYs. So Unique DIYs already knows that um, she won the giveaway because she was on my live that I did yesterday. But if you guys didn't know, Unique DIYs is the winner of my 100th subscriber giveaway. And thank you all so much for entering. You are all so sweet and kind. But without further ado, let's unbox a homemade mystery fidget blind bag. Okay, so this is the fidget blind bag that I have created. There is common fidget toys, not common fidget toys, rare fidget toys, epic fidget toys, and legendary fidget toys. I'm really hoping that I get a legendary fidget toy in this homemade fidget pack. So let's go ahead and open it. So as we can see, there's like little dotted lines. I think that's where we're supposed to cut to open up this fidget pack. So let's go ahead and cut this open. Okay, so I have some scissors and my mystery blind bag. So let's just go ahead and cut this open. Whoa. Okay, so I cut that open and now let's see what's inside. Okay, so um, I am hoping for the legendary fidget toys, but I'm just going to randomly choose inside and see what I get. Okay, so this is the first thing. Um, uh, I think you're supposed to open it from right here. It's like a little Ziploc baggy thing. Oh, there's a paper. Yellow. Okay, so yellow means rare. Oh my gosh, I got a rare, you guys. Ah! Okay, I'm super excited to see what the fitted toy is. <gasps> it's a Snappers! Oh, that is so cool. That is so cool, you guys. Oh, I love snappers. Oh, yes, I'm so excited that I got a rare. Oh, it's kind of hard to snap though, but that doesn't really matter. This is so pretty too, and it's like the rainbow kind. Oh, that is so pretty. I'm super happy that I got a Snappers as my first fidget toy. So let's move on to our next one and see what we get for the next fidget toy. Okay. I'm going to randomly pick again. What the? Oh my gosh, you guys. fidget toy which is green is epic ah, I got an epic fidget toy ah, okay okay I'm so excited you guys this is like so oh. oh my gosh i think this is like a rainbow neato stress ball but it is so great it feels like so amazing 
Oh, that is like such a nice feel to it. Ah. Oh, it almost feels like a dough ball because the insides aren't like a neato filling. They're like almost a tough feeling. Oh, like a dough ball would have inside, but it's not as tough as a dough ball would be. But that is just so cool. I love that so much. Okay, so since I'm super happy that I got an epic fidget toy, let's move on to the next one. Okay, so the next fidget toy, I'm gonna pick at random again. Okay. Oh, it feels very small. Oh. I'm gonna grab the paper first. What is this? It feels very weird. <gasps> OMG, it's a marble mesh. <gasps> and it's red. And red means, oh, I dropped it. Uh, red means common. So I got a common fidget toy. excited i really like marble mesh they like i don't know why like i know they're common and all but they are still such a great fidget to fidget with overall and i really like how they can like um like shrink like that i really just like pushing the marble back and forth um this is fun too but that kind of stretches out the mesh but, oh my gosh this is so cool Okay, so this I'm happy with. I'm very happy with this as a common. Oh, dropping everything today. Okay, so on to the next fidget. Okay, next fidget toy. So cool. Oh, this one feels very small. I wonder what this one is. Okay, I'm going to grab the paper first. Okay, I feel like orange is something super special. Okay, what is orange? Oh, orange is not common. That's still pretty good. I'm very curious. What is inside this? I have not gotten an orange yet. So what is inside this not common? <gasps> A bike chain! Oh my gosh! I have not, like, fidgeted with these in a long time. Especially, I like the thicker what whoa i like the thicker ones because the thicker ones are pretty much indestructible and i have a less chance of breaking the thicker ones but i so love bike chains like look at that how could you not like fall in love with that and i've like forgotten about them and like they were one of my favorites originally and i just forgot that they were an existing fidget toy because i got like too distracted with poppets and stuff like that but bike chains are so neat and i love Except for the fact that I keep dropping them. I love them so much. Like, they are so fun to fidget with. They're almost like an infinity cube because they do, like, the same thing as an infinity cube. They just go in and out, in and out. And, like, nothing really changes. I mean, they're still really cool fidgets, but, like, they do the same thing every single time. So it kind of reminds me of an infinity cube, yet you still get the same amount of enjoyment every time you flip it back, back and forth. So this kind of reminds me of a fidget cube. Or did I say a fidget cube? I meant an infinity cube. So that is so fun. And I dropped it again. So on to the next fidget toy. Next fidget toy. Oh, I can feel this. This is going to be a good one. <gasps> no way. Stop it. A legendary. This, I remember, is a legendary fidget toy. Look. Blue equals legendary. No way. Ugh, I can see why it's legendary though. Like, oh my gosh. Oh, it's a, like a tie-dye poppet and it is so cool. It's so colorful and I love this color so much. <gasps> I love this. Uh, and listen to the popping. That is like so good. I love the popping so much. Oh my gosh. That just like, ah, I'm so happy that I got this. Uh, this is so fun. No way. 
like these are like unicorn colors and they're so pretty it's like so wow i'm in love with this poppet i think this might be my favorite poppet ever now <gasps> yes a thousand times yes all right on to the next possibly last fidget toy i think we'll see okay no there is this is not the last fidget toy you guys there's one more but let's see what's in this one paper red which means common so what is this <gasps> it's a bean pod or a pea popper but i really love these things they're so cute like wow i was popping it the wrong way you cannot tell me that you do not fall in love with that face i mean look at that it's so cute but yeah uh these might be common but these are so fun and i love fidgeting with these ones um mine is kind of broken though i think i fidgeted it with i fidgeted with it too much i think i broke it over time so now this one you have to push it back in but i still love how cute these things are like how did they think of possibly to make these things so pretty and yeah i broke it again i think i fidget with it too hard like these bean pods are not for rough fidgeters fidget i don't know is that a word fidgeters fidgeters but they're not for rough fidgeters uh at all but I am a rough fidgeter, so this did not work out for me, but it is still so cute, and it's a keychain, which is so cool. So on to the next fidget toy. Oh, and the last fidget toy. Okay, so this is the last fidget toy. So, let's do this. I'm going to take the paper out first, but I'm very excited to see what this is. You guys, I'm not looking. What is this paper? Is it... I have a feeling it's going to be another rare, another yellow. But I don't know yet. Okay, three, two, one. <gasps> another blue! But it's legendary, right? Yes, it's another legendary. Okay, now I'm freaking out. What is this? Is it like a... I don't think a poppet could fit in here unless it was a mini poppet. So I'm hoping for a mini poppet because I love mini poppets. So, what are you? <gasps> OMG, it's like it's like a fidget pad. I haven't seen you in such a long time, Mr. Fidget Pad. No, but seriously, I haven't fidgeted with him in such a long time. It's felt like forever. Oh, I put him at the bottom of my fidget pile a long time ago and I have not seen him since. But Oh, there's just so many possibilities with the fidget pad. There's so many different things you could do. There's even this spot right here for texture if you'd like to, like, mess with it with your nails. There's, like, an on and off switch on the back, like that. And then there's, like, these buttons and this, like, thing that reminds me of a, like, a video game controller. The front reminds me of a video game controller. And then there's this spot right here where you can just roll your finger around the pad. And then there's just so many things on every different side and so many things you can do with this. So I'm super happy that I have gotten you today. So yes, um, I love that. Okay, so let's wrap this video up here. Okay, so my favorite fidget was probably going to be this or this. These two I really like. Um, this one because it just feels right, it, like feels amazing, and this one because it's like the prettiest poppet I've ever seen, so that is so pretty, and yeah, thank you all so much for watching this video, and if you have any more recommendations, I'd be happy to know them, so yeah, I will see you in the next video of Alyssa the Adventure, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel, bye!